What's up you guys, it's Rhythm Grub here. And today I'm driving, but we're not eating it. I just wanted to give a little background information on what I'm gonna eat today. Um, today I'm gonna be eating uh, this new halal spot. It's uh, called Alibaba, just like the, uh, the Asian market. It's like Asian Amazon. And uh, long story short, it's very close to my house and it's brand new, just opened. Um, I'm gonna go over and try it out. I'm gonna see how it tastes because I'm a huge fan of halal and uh, I'm pretty excited. So, next frame, I'm gonna be lunching. So, I'll talk to you later. So, it's done, it's been made. I got the halal. So, I got in there and it's brand new, everything you know, and stuff. I don't put my ratings into uh, the way the place looks. The, you know the quality of the service and stuff it's all about the food but i'm just saying it's brand new let me show you what the looks like so as you can see here it says alibaba and stuff like that you get a really strong seasoning kind of smell like a very curry like a very strong like i never really get that from Halal. usually halal doesn't really have that kind of smell well, it does a little bit, but not as much as this one smells like. But this was 10 bucks. Didn't have lamb. They only had chicken. So I got chicken over rice. With the less tomato onion and some uh, cucumbers, I think I got. So, um, and yeah, it was like 10 bucks. I got an energy drink with it too. Because uh, I like drinking energy drinks. It's good. So, um, the guy was very happy. He's very happy. I don't know guy lives for certain things and the guy up there was very happy that uh, it was running and shit so as a kid you guy hooked me up pretty good for 10 bucks a lot of food um it smells really strong really strong like like spice flavor like a spice i couldn't tell you the technicalities of that but i'm gonna just get right into it all right all right so alibaba and farmingdale right somebody's got a little bit of everything Fucking filled this shit up, man. All right, mid recording review. I never do this. This is very unique. Hello. Something about this chicken is just like so. Like it's very like. I've never had halal like spice like this this tastes so much different i just want to say that add the bloom like the veggies the lettuce and tomato are just so like fresh um which is not i've never really emphasized in halal like usually see halal it's kind of just there but this is like really popping i, I shouldn't i want to eat the rest of this so i can give you a full-blown i just want to point that out okay i almost forgot to make a review i almost left um, but I finished eating the halal um, that I got from Alibaba, uh, Main Street, Farmingdale, and this is my thoughts. So, um, the first thing I did, I took a bite of everything with the lettuce, tomato, a little bit of the cucumber and the onions with the chicken. And the one thing I wanted to say is the chicken is, uh, is very like real in that kind of sense. It tastes like a chicken that you, if you get, if you got like a thing of chicken breast and just cut it, it's like thick. That's when you know it's like good chicken. That's some good shit, which is understandable why it's, you know, 10 bucks there. That's some real shit. That, like you sometimes when you get chicken from like places like Shaw's around here, it's like not, it's a lot more soft. This is some real chicken. Uh, like, I don't know specific somewhat what it is but this is what it is you know i'm telling you so it's uh it's nice thick chicken uh i, I would rather like it cut cut up more uh they gave me a knife a plastic knife with my uh utensils so um i'd assume you could um you could get it and uh, you can cut it yourself if you want but um pretty much uh it tasted really good the chicken really popped um, whatever seasoning to put on the chicken is just absolutely unreal. It's just very tasty. Um, it's got a huge, like, difference compared to, like, what I've had with the halal. Like, usually 
plow chicken is doesn't pop like that usually has a, a like a little bit of flavor with the lamb that I have have uh, and uh, the white sauce and the hot sauce are really the most predominant flavors in the law but really chicken seasoning to put on here is really pops off gives me like a nice curry vibe and it's completely different from what I've ever had really unique and um, I would say the white sauce um, isn't that strong of a flavor I whenever I go to like halal guys um, the white sauce is really strong um, here it kind of reminds me of Shaz but a little like less um, a little less you know predominant it's more of an amplifier and um, um, so you know I could say like a uh, lubricant of um, just to make everything a lot less dry which is very nice because there's a good chicken flavor come out of the uh the chicken so it's very um different compared to like what i've had and the the rice has really good texture it's not mushy at all it's got a really nice texture to it not a lot of flavor coming out of the rice but um with that kind of chicken you know and, and the vegetables were absolutely fresh like absolutely um absolutely really fresh on both even fresher than the place that i usually like to go to like lindenhurst and uh, and lindenhurst right so it's but it's most most fresh most real chicken like I, like this is a completely different type of halal experience um it's crazy to think that this kind of halals comes out of like a place like the quickie mart there is is not that uh not that high quality but um i'm surprised and it was really good um I'd give it a solid 8 out of 10. It tasted really good, uh, really unique. Um, I would definitely come here every so often because it's just so much different compared to um, compared to the other places that I have around here. And it's uh, it's close to me too, so it's, I'm definitely gonna come again. Um, and I'm glad it's it's rolling. So and that's my review, man. Uh, it's uh, Alibaba Main Street Farmingdale. Um, that's it. Peace out.